If you've ever been told that time blocking is the way to get the maximum amount of effort and productivity out of your day, but it just doesn't jive with you, you are in the right place today. Hi, I'm Jennifer Maxwell. I'm a clarity coach and I help inspired entrepreneurs go from scattered and full of all these amazing ideas into aligned action so you can get traction for your business. So let's talk about the idea of time blocking. Let me just say this straight out. It works for many people, but it doesn't work for everybody. It doesn't work for me. Because how can you block inspiration, right? And like, I'm gonna be inspired between two and 4 p.m. It just doesn't seem logical. But there are some parameters that you need to take as an inspired entrepreneur to actually make sure we get something happening in our business. Because we can't just wander in the field of lilies and smelling daisies all day, hoping that we're going to get somewhere and you know make our business profitable and actually have some productivity. So here's some of my personal tips and the things that I do to make sure that I am ready when that inspiration strikes. And I also have some constructs around my day. And here is the, the number one reason why. Don't you ever notice that your creativity happens inside a box? Like meaning constructs and constraints actually cause your brain to get a little more creative. And that's kind of what we're going to do inside your day or your week to really help you uh, maximize that amazing energy that you have, but also to increase that productivity. Yes. Number one, always be ready, get dressed, start your day. Block the hours that you have available to do your work so that you can know where it is that you, you only have until X amount of time and those constructs help you get focused and get inside the productivity that you can produce inside your business. And number three, look at your week to come and figure out what those imminent or priority tasks are so that you can actually plunk those in and then you will know how much prep you need leading up and you can kind of fill in the sustenance and the maintenance all around that. I hope that helps. This, as an inspired entrepreneur, I know what it's like to be distracted and to have all these inspired ideas. And this is just how I pull my ideas together. And I hope that that helps for you. Comment below. If you haven't yet, subscribe, hit the bell so you get the notifications and let me know what you do to stay on track, even with all the shiny object syndrome that happens to us as inspired entrepreneurs. And I'll see you the next time.